Come on. Jesus Christ, that is ugly and disgusting. Right, I'm doing it. Okay, never mind. I'm um, low stamina as well. Don't move like that. Hello everyone, welcome back again to some more Grand. As you can see, we are back home and uh, last time we got very wet. This time, I don't know what we're doing. Like, I feel like, like you know, with most games, you know, you, you enter a part of the game that gets very climatic or like there's an important part. I feel like last episode was that climatic part because obviously if you didn't see it, I'd recommend go watch that. But basically, I found something and I gave it to my guy, and we now have so much other stuff that uh, I just have now, which I just shove in here. I still have yet to sort out my whole system that I've got going here, because this is kind of just all over the place at the minute. Just look at all of the stuff that I have, and it's just like everywhere. I can't fit anything into this. Whatever. Well, um, it is nighttime, actually. Let us sleep. Now, here's the interesting thing. Wake up. Bro, man, it's so... Bro, why would we sleep? It's like almost six o'clock in the morning. You know what? Yeah, after our entire whole adventure we did last episode, you would think that we would actually be like really knackered. But you know what? I'm actually good to go. So we can just go ahead and just, you know, carry on. And what are we doing? What are we doing now? Like, what, what do we need to do? Because I've got like so much... I've got so much random stuff on me that I just need to get rid of. I have discovered tadpole jerky. I've never eaten frog before. But I, I don't suppose how bad that is. Wow, well, we actually we actually got through all of the berry stuff. So I don't exactly know what to do. Obviously, if we look on the map, uh, we went we need to go over here. If we look, that says number three. That's the third super chip that we need. And we gotta get through all of this. Oh god, this, that's gas, that is dangerous. Now, obviously, there is like a whole load of other stuff. Like we even like, we explored, like we went to the, the I think that's the barbecue right there. We went all the way around. We never went like around this area. And obviously we never went around it because we can't get up there because we need to go all the way around there. So there's still quite a fair bit to explore. I don't think I've even explored around this area like fully. Like I've kind of just gone round like, there's even... The fourth one is literally there, which is quite close, actually, to be honest. And then you got all of this stuff here, and then all of that there, and then all of this, and then all God knows what's here. So, there's still a lot to do. Um, it's just where to start. But perhaps maybe we might have to get wet again and go back, because there's still quite a lot of... Um, there's still quite a lot of stuff we actually need to, like, get because there was some stuff when we went down there last time, there was some stuff that we actually couldn't get, probably because we didn't have the tools necessary. So let us go and have a look and see what I can do here. Okay, a stinger spear, red ant club, a spider fang dagger. Wait, that's a tier two dagger. A nimble dagger made from a wolf spider fang that poisons on hit. I need four venom? Are you serious? But that's a tier two, that's tier two dagger. I mentioned we needed that. Bro, are you serious? Tier two dagger, and I gotta go and kill those things. Honestly, um, this game, honestly. Jesus Christ, man. Okay, well, Bro, my hands, bro. I'm shaking. Right, well, give me all this. We may as well take all this sap. I don't know why. I think I've got way too much sap at this point. But who knows? That may change. Maybe we might consider building something. Like, there's so much stuff that I can just do. It's just the time to do it. But also, I don't want to. I don't want to bore you guys. I do want to keep like things quite entertaining. Oh my god. Right. Okay. I'm not exactly happy. But you know what? Okay. I see two of you in there. I cannot take on two. You are absolutely mugging. If I ever have to fight two wolf spiders, nah, man. It, it's done out here. I don't have a ranged weapon either. I've just realized that. Ooh, son. Damn, son. Hang on. 
We gotta go back. I I do not have a ranged weapon on me. Nani? Bruh. Oh, yeah. Bruh, I, I can't do that parkour thing for the life of me. I don't know why I built that there, to be honest. I thought it would be easy, but also, like, I had to make it so the creatures couldn't climb. Because they can climb up. I mean, my base hasn't actually been successfully attacked yet. I, I think we've had one raid this entire whole time, which... I'm not gonna lie, I would like to, you know, have more action. What am I needing? Oh yeah, a ranged weapon. I don't have, like, a bow on me. What happened there? Hey yo, what the f- I mean, I got a lot of spears. Is that gonna- Oh, I accidentally took all. That is annoying. I pressed W by accident. Oh wait, no, I do have a ranged weapon. Wait, I'm just- I'm just stupid. <laughs> I do have all these spears here, which you know what? Since like you know, I'm I'm advancing, you know, I I don't really need these spears anymore. So I'll do as I'll um I'll just use them, and then obviously I just won't pick them up. Um, I said we 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 got a proper armor on. You know what we could do with probably making a shield? I never made a shield last time because I'm again like I I don't know what I'm doing, but I think I've reached the point where I'm like good. Are you sure about that? So I also got some new arrows as well. Venom arrows, feather arrows, they do quite a bit of damage actually to be honest. Right, well I ain't gonna need that. You ever make a decision in life and regret it the second after? Because I'm regretting this situation even before I've done it. Right, it would help if I actually like had the spears equipped. Okay, for some reason I don't even have my bow equipped to my weapon. I don't know why I don't have that. Right, here we go. What was that? Oh, the bird's over there. Bro, why is that ladybug right there? Bro, don't you fight each other? Ah, the thing is, like, this place isn't, like, open. It's fine. Whatever. Right. Fire! I missed. Jesus Christ. Right, okay, you know what? Yeah, I was gonna not say anything. I'm just gonna concentrate and do it. Bro, focus. Right, come here. Oh, Jesus, don't jump like that. Whoa, what was that? Okay, I gotta make sure his friend doesn't get... Right. Right. Oh, I don't have my mutations on. Right. Poison you. Okay, this is quite... Oh, God. Ah. Come on. Jesus Christ, that is ugly and disgusting. Right, I'm doing it. Okay, never mind. Oh, I'm low stamina as well. Don't move like that. Right. Oh, bro, that is disgusting. Kill it! Alright, I got two venom out of that. Oh my god. That one spider, I lost half of my HP. Right, let me grab my stuff. Okay. You know what? Yeah, just out of curiosity, like, because, you know, like, I, I can kill them, I'm, I'm kind of curious how this arachnophobia safe mode helps. So if I just turn it all the way up, apply, and I just look and be like, that's a wolf spider. It does not look like a wolf spider. Okay, well, let's fight this thing, assuming I actually hit it. What am I seeing? This is a bit ridiculous. I actually don't know if this is better or not. This is like weird because, well, the thing is, it's because I already know what they look like. That's the problem. Like, if you want this arachnophobia safe mode to actually work, you just need to do this from the beginning and to not know. Like, I, I know what a spider looks like. Um, and the fact that I can still hear his like feet scuttering, that is absolutely disturbing. Thing is, I can't even tell. Like, it's kind of easier to indicate when it's going to attack. Give me my health back. Jesus Christ, I can't actually tell when it's attacking. Oh, God. Right. I, I killed it. I don't like how the feet... You can still hear the feet scatter. Like, if they remove that... 
that might have been a bit helpful. But it is actually kind of mad that I can just kill them now, like, as if they're just regular enemies, which... Fair enough, I guess. Right, well, I got four venom out of that. So that's what we needed for the dagger. So I guess we may as well just move on back. All right, so now we're going to try to build this dagger. Craft dagger. Cool. I, uh, you discovered a spider fang dagger. Look at us go. I actually have a tier two dagger now. Let me grab my smoothie stuff back. Can I actually make more of them at all? Or I can make more of the fluid flippers, but it's the liquid gills I need, but I need more flea. Obviously, I've mentioned before, the koi seems to be the only, like, enemy that I, I just need to avoid. So we'll just go with that. Right, I'm also going to stick these weird arrows away, because like, I, I, I don't really want to use them. I feel like they're, like, rare, so I think I only use them if absolutely necessary. I'll take... Do I even need the larva blade anymore? Because that poisons as well. This one also poisons, but the dagger does more damage. I think the larva dagger is also, like, made redundant for this. Uh, I have the dagger, I have the gills, and that's pretty much it. I'm just going to go and heal... And back in the water we go. All right, so here we go. We're back in the ocean once again, or the pond. I don't know why I call it an ocean. Like it, it's, it has the feelings of the ocean. Like I'm, I'm not a big fan of deep bodies of water. If only if there was like something that could like permanently. Right, one question. Can I? Okay, I can actually use the dagger. That would have been absolutely outrageously annoying if like I couldn't use the dagger because i know you can't use the lava dagger underwater for some reason there is a chest here mossy key there is a whole treasure chest there okay that's interesting right okay i think there is like yeah there's there's that light in the corner so there is something in that corner that we're gonna have to travel quite a lot of i hope i have enough stamina for this well not stamina oxygen my stamina has run out. Is this what I think it is? Oh god, I gotta do two sets of it? Give it. Oh, it is! It is the milk thingies, the teeth. I got that. Cool. Right, I need to get out and get back to some air, like, as soon as. So where... It's like in this... By this tube, I think. Hello. I may as well kill you guys. You're kind of just there. Oh, wow. They almost... Almost one shot. If I leveled up this dagger, it'd be pretty cool. Maybe I might consider doing that. We've got quite a lot of upgrade. Like, a lot of upgrade materials. So... Perhaps, maybe... Right, there's another little soggy root thing there. Let's go and grab some air first, and then we'll make our way back down. Give me that... Yes. I don't know why. I, mean, I think I can understand because I don't think we can use our hammer in here. I, I don't know where I'm going. I don't know why they couldn't just use the hammer, to be honest. Can I even use the hammer underwater? No, I can't. Okay. You know what? You know what would be really scary? If there was like some sort of serpent. Like them little, them little sea snakes. Those things. You discovered the depth's mouth. Um, not too sure how I feel about that. Well, there's quite a lot of you guys around. You know what? I might keep you guys alive. Where is this? Is this like the other side? Right. Give me, give me, give me the koi. This looks like it's the other way. Yeah, this, this takes me back to the lab. Okay. So there's just another place that I discovered. Wait a minute. Hang on a minute. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I swear I got like a mutation that I could use. Let me deactivate that one. I ain't gonna need that one. Yeah. Mutation. There we go, so I can swim faster and breathe for a little bit longer. Don't know why I didn't put that on the first time I came in, but that's probably because I didn't know that that existed. But there's no other secret way around here. No, this is like another way into the lab. Okay, fair enough then. I'm starving again. Okay, we're back in the wedding ring. So, where was that pathway? That pathway was like near the tree. Okay, well, I tried to eat all of the raw food and it didn't actually increase my hunger at all. That's a bit... Are you serious? I'm now sick and it didn't even, like, increase my hunger at all. Ah, here we go. Mushrooms. If I really wanted to, I could just eat all these, to be honest. I know Hoops probably doesn't like mushrooms, but you know what? At the end of the day, bro, survival. That's all that matters. Cool, there we go. I'm a little bit hungry. I'm a little bit damaged, but that's fine because I can drink one of them. 
And we're pretty much back to normal. I could probably go grab more tadpole meat whilst I'm at it. And I need to go back over to the tree. Find that cave I was in last time. Okay, I think I think I see the cave. I think I see the cave. Okay, no, I think this is pretty much the same one. Uh, right. Put that on. Oh god, there's quite a lot of you. Right. Come here. I just need your air. Now, where was I? Ah, it's back here. Here we go. I remember you. Yes. Got a mega. Right. You can just die. Okay, so I think I remember there being another one. I don't know how many there is in here. I'm only going to the ones that I know exist. So... When it comes to finding anything else out... I don't know. Well, I guess with the collection of the teeth and everything, maybe we can see if we can... Uh, what we got? I got three and two. What can I do? So I can give myself either max stamina, max health, healing, or if I wait until I find one more, I can have another mutation. I think the mutations might be helpful, actually. I got two mega thingies. I'm not exactly too sure. Is the arrow stacks? Oh, you know what? Let's just give me more arrows. I think I can make like something as well. What quests have we got? Clover Shingards, Bombarda Beetle, and the Sand Castle. Um, well, I mean, we can do that one. I could probably do that one. I have no idea where the Sand Castle is. So, just... Just reject that one for now. Okay, well, it is night time. Night mode initiated once again. This time, we'll be able to sleep. And, um, probably might end the episode as well, actually, to be honest. I know this is probably like not much to do, but I just wanted to make sure. Like I do remember, there is like a, a card. Like we need some key to get through to some of the areas. So we have to come back to the pond here anyway, actually, to be honest. But I just thought, you know, I'd grab the stuff that I can and sleep to morning. Perhaps maybe we might actually press. Oh. Wait, what's this? Wait, is it because I collected another one of the chips? Like, every time I capture a chip, I get a dream? Because I think I remember I had one before. Okay. Specimen vitals are you are massive. <laughs> Looks like we've done it. Great job, everyone. Let's set up three more trials for replication. Uh, sorry to crash your party. The Defense Department has arrived early to discuss Project Orc. Project Orc, Your what is that? Present in the meeting. <sighs> Not sure what's worse, our director or a three-hour meeting with the military. God, man, why is always the military? When it comes to, like, science like this, like, why is it always... Wake up, Hoops. More bad dreams. You know what, yeah, maybe we shouldn't get the chips. They are doing tests on me. Uh, I hate needles. Project Orc sounds real bad. Well, unfortunately, I do not possess the knowledge to understand what that means. And, uh, you hate needles. Look what's in your hand. Look is what is in your hand. A needle. For some reason, I don't have a dandelion tough on me. I gotta go get one of them. Wait, they're not back yet. They must take a couple days to, like, respawn or something. Because they're not here. Unless they're in the ceiling. Oh my god. You know how... You know how... Nah, you know what? I'm not even going to go in there. There's probably no reason to go in there. Like, I do not want to see one, like, crawling on the roof or anything. Or, like, on the ceiling or whatnot. If I ever see one of them does that... Hell no. I don't why. I don't know why I make myself so uncomfortable on purpose. There's no reason for me like this. Right, well, I'm just going to end this episode here. Again, uh, a bit of a very random one. I mean, I fought a couple of I fought a couple of wolf spiders. I got more teeth thingies. You know, it's all about the exploration now, and that's pretty much it, to be honest. I mean, I mean, I think next next episode um, we will uh, prepare for the. Um, 
Well, my guy was like skidding his way through there. But yeah, like this, this was kind of like a random like relax. A little bit of relaxation, you know. Look, this episode was a little bit of, you know, a relaxing episode, sort of, you know, given what we did last time. And obviously, you know, we've discovered more lore since we went to sleep and we've had that dream. So I think that happens every time we uh, retrieve one of the chips. We receive more information, more about the story, and everything else that accompanies it. So until we are graced with a chance to meet again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell. And until the next time where um, we will actually prepare to head back to the dead zone once again. And uh, I guess we f try and find the lab, which I tried to find ages ago. Uh, but that is something we will deal with next time. So until then.